The idea behind the LBS Photography Awards is that pictures and visual storytelling can help and support business and how business can have an impact on society, on, on our planet. The Wheeler Institute for Business and Development is putting together several activities and this is one of our very first ones that are really trying to put a spotlight on how business and social impact come together, but in creative ways. These exhibits are a powerful way to tell stories that we normally tell in a different format. This Photography Awards has been lucky enough to be partnered with Canon and also have world-class photojournalists who've actually engaged with us and are represented in our winning selection. With this award, with its theme of transforming lives through business, we really want to connect the corporate world of social responsibility with our industry to shine a light on the amazing work that businesses can do. Behind the exhibition, there is a competition. We received more than 200 submissions from more than 50 different countries. Our winning selection was with Pascal Metra, a French photojournalist. The story I did is about the lack of electricity in uh, sub-Saharan Africa with a major problem, 620 million of people who have not get access of electricity in Africa. This competition was an opportunity for me to show my work to another audience, especially to one audience who will be in a position to have important responsibility in the future. The opening has been an opportunity to have also some speakers talking about pressing issues in sustainability and social impact. We're going to explore this link between business, the arts, photography, and its impact that it has on the world. Malaria patients don't really have as much a voice as, for example, patients living with HIV AIDS have. We wanted to give the malaria patients, you know, want to give them a face. So those images play a very important role. I think that's what art does really, really powerfully, is it, is it captures things which news articles can't. It's people who make stories. It's the people who benefit from these malaria drugs, from all of these social impact initiatives. It's their stories that actually resonate more than the data. So in addition to coming this year to see this inaugural exhibit, we would love to have people participate next year as a way to be part of this conversation and use visual storytelling to actually convey really important ideas about our role and responsibility as businesses in society.